hi there students to cos it as an, as a verb or an adjective cosseted okay to cos it is to pamper to care and protect but too much so notice very often cosset is used in a negative sense but not always so children today live very cosseted lives their parents are overprotective and the children are given everything they want as a result the children become spoiled I think in the West, governments tend to cosset their populations, to try to protect them too much and say what they can and can't do. So to cosset, to treat like a favourite pet, um, to give a person everything they want, everything they could imagine, and to protect them against all and every danger so that the realities of life out there do not affect them. The problem is that if children are cosseted, they don't learn to deal with the real world. Um, if they are cosseted, they are not able to resolve their own problems they just expect someone else to solve their problems for them because it's always been like that so to cost it either to pamper to give some, someone or something everything it needs um and maybe to be overindulgent to do this too much so the seedlings of this plant are very sensitive and need to be cosseted. During my stay at the spa, I was cosseted and pampered and treated like a king. So maybe here cosseted is not negative. They, treat, they gave me everything I needed. So to cosset, to indulge or to overindulge somebody, to wrap up in cotton wool, to mollycoddle, to spoil, to cater to their every whim, to treat with too much kindness. The car cossets the driver and makes any journey a pleasure. The problem is the driver is so cosseted, there's a tendency to fall asleep because you're just so comfortable and everything is so easy. Budget airlines. In no way do budget airlines cosset their passengers. Yeah, they, you, they don't look after them. They just give them the travel. After a long ordeal, difficult situation, I decided to stay at home and cosset myself for a few days. So, positive and negative. To look after, to pamper, or to overindulge. To overprotect. So, if a child is cosseted, this is very definitely a criticism and negative. The parents are too protective and overindulgent. But uh, modern technology can cosset my life in many ways, can pamper, make it easier. So, next question, formality. I think I'd probably give this word a 7 in formality, maybe even 7.5. I think informally to pamper or to spoil. Um, I think it sounds a bit old fashioned and a bit literary, but it's a nice word to use. I'd, I'd use this for semi formal and formal things. Cosseted in an informal conversation, maybe, but not really. So, what about the origin? Well, apparently in 16th, the 16th century, a cosset 
was a lamb that was brought up by hand. So maybe the mother had died and you have the lamb, so you give it milk from a bottle and you treat it, you pamper it incredibly well and like that it survives. I think later that developed into the idea of a spoiled child, a cosseted child. He's so spoiled and cosseted. So, to cosset, to pamper, to overindulge, to overprotect. Yeah? So, being cosseted is not a good thing. We need to face up to the realities of, of life and the world that we live in. Notice as well, to cosset is a regular verb. Um, they cosseted the child. They have cosseted the child since he was born. Okay? So, there you go. If you enjoyed the video, I won't cosset you anymore. Give it a rating. Subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you soon. Bye for now. Cosset. Cosseted.